Hello everybody. In this video, I will explain the concept of strategic analysis. Strategic analysis is the process of assessing an organization's internal and external environment to understand its current position, identify opportunities and threats, and formulate effective strategies to achieve its goals. It involves systematically gathering and analyzing data related to the organization's resources, capabilities, market dynamics, competition, industry trends, and macroeconomic factors. The main objectives of strategic analysis are to identify strengths and weaknesses. Through strategic analysis, we may be able to identify the internal positives and negatives that the organization has with respect to its resources, with respect to its workforce, with respect to its technological efficiency, etc. Through this, the organizations may be, uh, may be able to leverage their strengths to achieve their organizational objectives and come up with strategies to mitigate the weaknesses that they have. The second objective is to assess opportunities and threats. Opportunities and threats refer to the external factors that would positively and negatively impact organizations. So through strategic analysis, we will be able to identify these opportunities and threats and plan our processes accordingly. The third objective is to formulate strategic options. After doing multiple strategic analysis, we may be able to arrive at a picture of what we have what we have to do and where we have to be. Based on this, we will be able to formulate efficient strategic options. The fourth objective is make informed decisions. Through strategic analysis, we would have got a clear idea of us as an organization plus the external environment. With all these knowledge inputs, it would be greatly easy for us to make informed decisions. The fifth objective is adapting to changing conditions. Strategic analysis would certainly help organizations to adapt to changing conditions because these analyses give organizations an input of what is there outside. There are multiple strategic analysis frameworks. A few noteworthy frameworks are SWOT analysis, Porter's Five Forces, Pestle analysis, Value Chain analysis, Balanced Scorecard, BCG Group Share Matrix, Ansoft Matrix, Blue Ocean Strategy, etc. There are different components in strategic analysis, namely internal analysis, external analysis, and competitive advantage. Internal analysis refers to assessing the organization's resources, capabilities, and core competencies. External analysis refers to evaluating the industry and market environment including competitors, customers, and regulatory factors. Competitive advantage refers to identifying sources of competitive advantage such as cost leadership, differentiation, or focus strategies. The different analytical techniques that can be used are market segmentation. Firstly, we need to divide the market into distinct groups based on characteristics and needs. Value chain analysis examining the sequence of activities that create value for customers and analyzing cost and differentiation drivers. By knowing the value additionals plus the cost and differentiation drivers, we may be able to plan all our actions accordingly. Benchmarking, comparing performance metrics with industry peers or best-in-class companies to identify areas of improvement. We shall always have the best-in-class companies as our role models and strive towards surpassing them at performance metrics. Strategic options. There are multiple strategic options, namely business-level business strategies, which involves choosing between cost leadership, differentiation, or focus strategies to achieve a competitive advantage. Corporate-level strategies encompass Deciding on expansion, diversification, vertical integration, or strategic alliances to enhance overall performance. International strategies 
focus on assessing the feasibility and risks of entering foreign markets through exporting, licensing, franchising, or direct investment. Implementation and Evaluation The first step is strategic implementation, developing action plans, allocating resources, and, and aligning organizational structure and culture with strategic goals. Performance Measurement Establishing key performance indicators and benchmarks to track progress and evaluate strategy effectiveness is certainly very important. Adaptation and control, monitoring external changes and internal performance and making adjustments to strategies as necessary to maintain competitiveness. Hope this video was of help to all of you in understanding strategic analysis. In the further videos of this lecture series, we will be discussing on each of the strategic analysis tools in detail. Thank you.